It's teacher Michelle and we hope you enjoyed the last three weeks of Tuesday Doodle with Abraka Doodle. And we have Splat here with me, okay? So I guess you remembered him. This is our mascot. And last three weeks we did the Tuesday Doodle and we talked about um, three artworks. We did three artworks, right? So first was um, inspired by Van Gogh, the vase. Hope you enjoyed it. And then the second one was inspired by a book about um, the three mice, right? And then we learn about primary colors too and mixing them and become secondary colors. And then for the third one, which was last week, we learned about um, Kusama Yayoi, who is from Japan, right? A Japanese artist. So we're done with the Tuesday Doodles. We have something new for you this week and we'll be doing um, Splat doodle, okay? So this one is a splat doodle challenge that um, is actually free. Everyone, there's no age limit. Um, anyone could actually join, okay? And then do your artwork at home. It's a simple thing. You can use any materials that you have at home. If you don't have paints with you, that's fine. We can always stick to the normal crayons and papers or pencils or even um, colored pencils or markers, okay? or even some colored papers that would do as well. Colored papers and scissors, you can use them too. All right, so today we're going to be inspired by another famous artist, okay? His name is P.A. Mondrian. He's a Dutch artist. He's famous for his abstract works, okay? He's from pop era and he used a lot of bold lines and primary colors. Do you remember your primary colors? So. Can you tell me what are your primary colors again? Okay, yes, it's red, yellow, blue, all right? Okay, one good thing or one um, information about um, P.A. Mondrian, he's passionate about dancing and he loves to dance. However, he don't like slow music, okay? He don't like the traditional dances like waltz or tango, but he loves um, dancing with fast energy and he loves to dance with dancing with different styles all right so today again we're going to learn and we're going to be inspired by P.A. Mondrian who is a Dutch artist and he loves dancing and one thing about him is that he uses primary colors okay so we can create our artwork you can use anything that you like you can use a collage you can use some papers to create a collage. You can use your markers with you. So what I have here with me are markers. So I have the red, yellow, and blue, all right? But I do have my black as well because we'll need it for outlining and then creating some lines and drawing some shapes, all right? So I'm going to show you one of the artworks that I've already started. You can create your lines, all right? I have already started creating my artwork art piece so i'll just be adding some lines again and we'll be using black to create some lines if you like you can draw anything that you like any shape i mean but we're sticking this one and we're sticking with squares rectangles because if you google his artworks you will see a lot of inspiration about the primary colors the red yellow blue painting red, yellow, blue painting, and then we can color it again. We can color the insides with marker. You can use another color that you like. This is just a sample. You, remember, you're the artist, so you can do your work. You can draw your own shape. You can draw your favorite shape you can even draw like a heart and then create some lines over there and um, create some squares rectangles and then color them with red yellow blue the primary colors that's our focus over there all right all right okay so let's go ahead and continue doing your art piece and masterpieces and you can show us um you can tag us in social media and share it with us 
you can tag us using hashtag Splat Doodle and um, you can tag us at Africa Doodle Singapore, okay? And again, um, we will be having this Plat Doodle Challenge every Tuesday. We're going to give you a short preview and then maybe you can share your artworks with us. And um, we will be having online classes, live online classes starting next week, Monday and Tuesdays. If you wanted some details, you can always message us. And we will also be having holiday camps, um, from Wednesdays to Fridays, 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. You can also message us about that, all right? So stay safe, stay well, and we'll look forward to seeing your artworks. And um, yeah, see you next week for the next Splat Doodle Challenge, all right? Bye!